Hello, my name is David DeVos. I'm a neurologist and professor in pharmacology and my career is dedicated to develop a new therapeutic strategy for neurodegenerative disease, and notably Parkinson's disease and of course what we said disease modifying drugs so to try to uh, stop or even reverse the progression of the disease. So why deferiprone is so important for a Parkinson's disease? Because as uh, several independent clinical trials, pilot clinical trials, uh, which showed that uh, deferiprone was able to improve the condition of Parkinson's disease. So what is deferiprone? It's an iron chelator, but at small dose, it has this ab its fantastic ability to do a conservative mode of iron chelation, meaning that it chelates iron, and it can redeploy iron in the body. Why is it important to chelate iron? So it's important to re reduce the iron accumulation that we can find in the substance nigra of people having Parkinson's disease. And we know, because there's many, many studies demonstrated that this accumulation is toxic and fasten oxidative stress and cell deaths. So we are now with a large trial uh, named FairPark 2. It's a European-funded trial, uh, and this FairPark 2 trial have already enrolled 343 patients at the stage of de novo. They just received the diagnosis, and we follow them for 10 months with nine months of treatment, either defibrillin or placebo. And we, uh, uh, we need to enroll 30 more patients. And so we will have, by the end of uh, 2020, hopefully, the result of uh, this new strategy of disease modifying. Uh, what are the most uh, areas are very, very attractive is uh, there's, there's a lot. Um, and we observe at the Link Clinical Trial Committee there's many, many strategies that are very fantastic and promising. Among them, there's a strategy that I really love is to try to combat the cell death. For years, we believed that the cell death was only apoptosis. And now we know that there's many different types of cell deaths. Among them, there's ferroptosis. And ferroptosis is um, uh, associating this iron accumulation and a huge lipid peroxidation and also glutathion depletion. So it can recapitulate all the pivotal old marks of Parkinson's disease. And what is really interesting with ferroptosis is that there's a lot of new molecules that can counteract ferroptosis. So it's a new field of research. And among them, there's an epi molecule uh, old by bioelectron and this molecule has fantastic action and they can inhibit uh, some enzyme a clue to uh, avoid the toxicity and lipid peroxidation and so the cell deaths. And uh, what is cool is that we can enter this clinical trial in the next coming months, hopefully.